Good morning, good afternoon, good evening from wherever you're watching this from. I hope that you all are doing great from your respective classes. Welcome back yet again to another video and to another story. We saw Duchess Megan out and about at her hairdresser's event. All Harry and Megan do for their true and real friends is that they do show up. And they do show up looking absolutely gorgeous. Stunning is an understatement. Duchess Megan was art. Her skin, flawless. Her smile shows of how unbothered she is. And she's just basically enjoying life and what not. And what for. And tell me why the Rangers have made a story out of it. The Rangers are, you know, struggling to adjust to the reality or to the fact that, you know what, these people are doing much better and good. But what they had expected, anticipated, and thought it would happen. What's your thinking? Because the Rangers were crying saying that Megan came out looking fresh and uh, was done on purpose to contrast the image of the other woman that came out on Sunday. They are so angry at how good she looks. After all the abuse they gave her, yet the one they praise looks like, man, they are like, doesn't she read our tweets? Why isn't she bothered? Why doesn't it look, uh, you know, why doesn't it show on her face after all these years? Oh, Lord. That's why I always say it's a one-sided uh, battle. They are fighting amongst themselves. Because I and Megan have no time for trash. They have no time to shock themselves in negativity, in hate. They have no time for that. No, they don't. That just make and just looks like, you know what, she is in that chapter of hers, you know, of joy. Like, she looks amazing. She looked amazing. Compared to the other woman that they are telling us about, the one that showed up on Sunday, and the streets were very much clear. It's as if people were not at any particular point drawn to go see. They are princes. Too bad. Too bad. What do you have to say about this? What do you think about this? I'm always like, you know what? Harry and Meghan just got started. The same way they are still ravishing and crying about, you know what? Harry and Meghan looking bothered. Harry on the other side that keeps winning, keeps getting, you know, recognition globally. Megan on the other side, whenever she shows up, she does show up. She does show up, plucking gadgets. And yeah, that one is pissing them off. That one is killing them from inside. That one is uh, hurting them a lot, but that's it. Somebody said she looks good. She looks like a man, even when, uh, you know, that's now a comment to the other woman. She looks like uh, a man, even when pigs are, are photoshopped. Because looking at her event on Sunday, it wasn't successful. As per what media outlets are preaching out here. They never speak out that sure. But whenever something successful happens for Harry and Meghan on the other side, they will turn that upside down. They will want to tarnish it upside down. But for the other ones, for the left behind, they are so much on the front line of spreading it. So much on the front line of just making Harry and Meghan look like the bad ones in the picture. Like, these people need uh, to just accept. But you know what? It's never going to be the same again. 
it's never gonna be the same again they want women they stand no chance of having them back harry and megan are in that chapter of joy because the glory the growth is very much evident very very much evident somebody commented and said they are unfulfilled insignificant and pathetic Megan is better than every single one of them put together. Who wants the life of a jealous, irrelevant, racist loser? Megan is thriving and the racist can stand it. They will just have to cop. They will just have to adjust to it, Corazza. You know, backwards and never forward forever. No matter they aren't looking back. They are never looking back, you know. When you are beautiful on the inside and soul purpose is pure, you are beautiful on the outside. Jealous much get. And that's why all they do is win, win, win. And they won't stop. They don't stop. And it's not like they are looking for it, but instead... The winds are luck for them because their work speaks for itself publicly. Everything of theirs is out here and uh, it's on point. Everything of theirs is working out for good. Everything of that is working right for what they had visionized, uh, you know, thought about and whatnot and what for. But for the other party, everything they had anticipated and hoped that will happen to Harry and Meghan seems to fall flat. Seems to fall flat. It's not working right. It's not working right. And that one is bothering them, piecing them off to the wall. They had predicted about Harry and Meghan's divorce, and it seems it's working so much well with William and Kate. They had predicted about, you know, Harry and Meghan's going bankruptcy, fallout, and whatnot, and what. But looking at the embarrassments that William and Kate have to deal with every now and then, it's disgusting. It's disgusting. What's your tech? What's your thinking in all of this? Just let me know your thoughts in the comment section. And hoping to see you guys in our next more videos to come.